Genesis chapter 3, verse 8, the Bible tells us that every day when he created Adam, in the cool of the evening, he will come in there and begin to walk with him. What was he doing? He was having a relationship with him. And that is why on a particular day, God comes in the cool of the evening and Adam was hiding. Adam and Eve, they were all hiding. So God says, where are you guys? He said, this time, when you came, we were afraid. <laughs> the only time you get afraid with your relationship with God is when the sun comes in. Amen? And that is why we must live a holy life. If you are here with me, give me a believing amen. Because what sin does is that sin gives you a sense of guilt. And when you carry that sense of guilt, you can't have the fellowship you must have. Now, when we were young believers, what, <laughs> it was very easy to, to know that a Christian brother or sister is not living right. With, with, without even praying. You see that suddenly we're doomed. Hmm? Suddenly we're doomed, we're doomed, we're doomed. Huh? That person, I mean, used to be vibrant in the Lord, and they are not suddenly, suddenly they are not vibrant anymore. Suddenly they are heavy. Why? Because sin has come in, and once sin comes in. You can't fellowship with the Lord. You are hiding. You, are, you feel guilty. And the devil likes that. The devil will, will hold on to that guilt and will torment you and will stop you from fulfilling your God-given goal. There are many Christians that God had great plans for. And because of sin, the devil held them captive. The devil held them with guilt. And so they couldn't fulfill they are greatest potential. May that never be your story. Amen? By mistake, if sin comes in, please. I'm saying by mistake because the normal thing is that sin must not come in. Are you here with me? Tell somebody the normal sin is that sin must not come in. The Bible says, He who is born of God does not sin. What, it, what, what in fact it, it should be it should be interpreted he who is born of God does not live in sin amen if you are born of God you can't live in sin you are not married to the guy and you and and, and you, are, you are okay there's, there's something wrong with you you are not born of God born of God and you are stealing from your boss, stealing in the shop, you are not born again. Because if you are born of God, you don't live in sin. If you are here with me, give me a believing amen. 